Um, I thought Chadrack was great. I was glad we got hooked up with him. Um, we could always be in contact with him. We always felt safe with him. He showed us around a lot, and our host family was very great. I was very pleased. What was the most surprising thing you experienced in the program? Probably how little the children had. Um, some of them only have one meal a day, and that's the lunch that's provided in school. Also, the school condition. Um, there's just a lot of dust. Some of the roofs have problems, and the chalkboard, some of them have problems as well. So it made me realize um, how much work needed to be done. What was the most surprising thing you experienced in the host family? Um, we didn't talk too much. They were busy working or taking care of the house, but they are always very, very friendly and very helpful. Any surprising thing you experienced in the country? Um, some places were extremely, extremely undeveloped, while others were developing at a faster rate, so I was just surprised at how different the two were. What was the most challenging thing you experienced in the program? Probably knowing that a lot of these children either lost one parent or both parents or lost their whole entire family altogether. Um, they had so little and then they still come to school with a smile on their face, so it's challenging but also very inspiring at the same time. Any challenges you had in the first family? Um, no challenges with the family, like language barrier of course, and wishing we had talked more, like with Cecilia who we stayed with, but they are all very nice. Any challenges you had in the country? Um, language and culture, we learned some tree, which was very helpful over the two week stay. Um, the culture is just different from America, so it was just um, hard to get accustomed to. Any tips for future volunteers, clothing, personal items, donations? Prepare to sweat a lot. I sweat all the time, so it's really gross. Um, I brought a lot of workout shorts, which are accepted. I know it says like it's to be like a little weary about that, but shorts are fine. Um, just bring a lot of like medicine and supplies, and you can leave it here for like donations. And I liked that I brought some books because it entertained me at night, like right before I went to bed. Personal paragraph about the experience you had during the program. Um, my experience was absolutely amazing. I would do this all over again if I could. Um, I've been touched by every child and every adult, every person I worked with here. They have opened my eyes to what life can be like with not the best structural developed conditions, um, but what happiness is truly like. Like here, I really understood the saying, money doesn't buy happiness. How would you describe your accommodation, new security, friendliness? Um, I shared a bedroom with my best friend Emily, who came with me, um, and then another girl who only stayed a week, uh, Tracy, she had her own room, and then we all shared a bathroom, so it was nice. It's kind of like bunking with friends. How would you describe the security system? Security, I always felt safe. I never had a problem with anything, um, especially with Shadrach and John. John, he used our security going some places. <laughs> so we, it was great. Everyone's very friendly here. What was your favorite memory of this trip? Um, my favorite memory of the program, I would say teaching third, fourth, and fifth um, English. Um, I really bonded with those kids a lot, and a few of the younger ones too, but because I got to spend an hour with each grade each day, like it made me learn all of their names, take pictures with them, um, play so many games, and it was a lot of fun. Any favorite memory of the host family? Uh, Cecilia's chicken dinner with rice and salad. I love her tomatoes. Um, I love playing Uno with Shadrach and John after school. It got very intense sometimes. Any favorite memory about the country? Our trip to Cape Coast Castle, definitely, um, and then the gorgeous, exhilarating canopy walks in the cocoon forest. That was so much fun. How was the road of view you as support crew traveling? Who helped you with emails, phone calls, chat online? Um, Sarah, I talked to the most. She was really, really good at getting back to us ASAP. What do you think about the reservation system online? It was fine. It was very easy. Who did you find at road of view website, and what keywords did you use? Um, Google, I just did safe organization to that volunteer in Ghana. Are you willing to speak to all the potential and all of you volunteers? 100%. Thank you so much for volunteering with us. Thank you. Madasi.